Whoa! Damn these fucking wolves. With quick movement, your sword slashes the one of the wolves with ease. To your left, your left! Rolling, Sif. As you throw one wolf, your head ducks just in time with a 13 as another one jumps overhead. God. Stay in the center, Soma. You'll be fine. I got it, I got it, I got it. Left! Jesus Christ. As you try to go in for a cut for one of the wolves, another one comes in, and unfortunately, with a natural one, it bites into your leg. But luckily, with your armor for three, you're fine. I don't have armor. Oh no, it was it was oh, Kyla. Me. Oh you're me? Fine. Oh. Okay, I thought it was me. That'd yep. I'm good. Natural one for you. You have an injury to your leg. <laughs> ah! Shit! No! Fuck! Take care of the wolves and I'll bandage it up on a proper. Seth, be careful. I am. Gotcha. No die rules. Get yourself treated. <laughs> one by one, the wolves move quick and fast as you slowly cut away one by one. No, you don't! What? <laughs> the 13, you find purchase with your blade as you pierce the heart of one of the wolves as it slumps before you, coming forward. Watch it, watch it over there! As it falls to the ground, lit. Your blades find purchase again from one of the wolves and collapse to the ground. You all see but one wolf left as it slowly walks away, seeing all its comrades torn apart. Throwing my axe at it. Rolling. Fuck. Number 14. It's Rick. I know I got it. I know that that's a crit, so I'm gonna clamp it. Oh, God. You feel the clamps dig deep upon your flesh against the fangs that pierced into the boots. It's painful. Ah. But with time, you're able to Fuck. feel the wound slowly close up as blood slowly stops to pour. Fucking things. There we are. Thank you, Soma. Good call bringing Soma. No problem. <sighs> okay. Alright, where to? You see the le less and less wolves that are around now as their bodies lay scattered before you. Uh, huh? Seth, you see where they the came wolves? from? Alright, well, I mean, I'm not a hunter or anything, but I say we check where they came from. Maybe it'll lead us to your priest. Right. Kill some fucking Maybe, wolves. You know wolves don't behave like this. They don't just charge forward from a hill. It's very odd behavior. Why do they do that? That's not anything. Well, right, Shriek? Just angry. Why the hell did they attack her? Therefore, you're right. That's not normal. Well, definitely owe you one after this. Yeah. <laughs> not, not my blood. This isn't normal for good. wolves. They shouldn't have attacked us like that. What do you mean? Especially seeing our numbers. Soma, you remember one of them were injured. It's the pack tactics, strength. yes, that's normal, but... They shouldn't... Uh, they shouldn't have just swarmed Sith, us coming off question. that hill like that. Sure, what is it? One of the one of the wolves were injured when they started to attack us, yet they attacked <sighs> anyway. Aren't they supposed to, well, you know, back off if they are? Usually they do, which means it's probably something chasing them, which means you we need to there? be careful. Yeah, up there. No, that doesn't look like something to chase, unless but it's desperation for food. I have no idea what's going on. Well, we gotta keep moving if you want to find your priest.
As you all begin to trudge forward through the grass, bit by bit, you see the markings of the wolves more and more, and you start seeing something else as well. You're starting to see the splatters of blood on the ground here and there. And you notice something right away. You see a bunch of arrows pierced in the ground as well, hidden among the brush. Look at this. You're not able to tell where they came from, but they're arrows. Arrows. People are taking with us. Hmm. Hunters? Does it look like human style arrows or elven? I'm not a Fletcher. You can have a look if you want. Diff with a five. Uh, it, it's really hard to tell. They're not the finest craftsmanship, but they're not the worst either. Mm. You can't tell. Sadly. Not, not great, not bad. Well, let's keep moving. Don't know what they are, though. As the further and further you move up, the sound of rushing water catches all your ears. Could be bandits. It's the river. Could be. Wait, something over there. Mm -hmm. Is that a tent? As you've gotten closer and closer, it's hard to tell how many are there. Uh, some are hidden in brush, maybe some are in the tent. But you do see one man who's tied up, bloodied, and you see an arrow in his leg. And you see another person injured on the ground as well, covered in blood. A few of them have a slight limp to their steps, but... You see the one man stands out as different compared to all the others. Does he look like he's wearing robes, or...? The man doesn't seem to adore any robes at all, actually. You only see the blue tunic. But he is tied up. You would have also noticed he had a gambeson on, as well. Looks like a small camp. There's a couple of injured people hit with arrows and someone tied up wearing a gambeson. I don't know how many people there are in total. Someone tied up. Is it the one in blue? Yeah. You were absolutely terrifying. The priest wears blue. Uh, okay, what's that move? Was he injured? Could you tell? Yeah, he was tied up and sitting down. I didn't get a good enough look, I guess. There is definitely someone injured. I don't know if it's him there. Sif says there's a bridge back there that we could take to go across. My only concern is if we go too late, he could bleed out if he's injured. Mm. We'll have to be quick then. How many men are there? How many men did I see? God, roughly. Sadly, with the six, it was hard to tell. You remember seeing maybe three, four from what you could see, but with all the brush and the tent, there's no way of knowing how many are there. From what I could see, maybe three or four, but it's a bad line of sight. Maybe a little more. I don't know how many of them are combatants. What do you suggest? Well, we're gonna have to cross this river, river one way or another. I don't fancy my chances against the tide, so we'll have to cross the bridge anyway. Right? It'd probably be safer. Yeah. Besides, I don't want to play four silver at the past house. <sighs> You're worried about that more than anything. Taking the lead us to the bridge. We'll have to be quick.
to move up forward. Something catches your eye. You see movement ahead. You peek around and you see them both separate quite far. One's tightening their armor, and the other one's looking to handling business. <clears throat> the general vibe that I'm getting from these guys is that they're not very savory people. They're probably bandits, right? From what you can tell, they look very rough. Some of them have some scratches and marks on their bodies. Their armor is all mismatched. Possible. That are rough, rough mercenaries. He's going to get, um, Harry's attention. He's going to point to the people close to him and then make, like, a across-the-throat gesture and a questioning like that. Say again? He's gesturing to Harry. He's gesturing to this guy. He's going to make a slitting of the throat gesture and then questioning. Okay. Slowly, you saw the confirmation to move ahead. Get it done. From behind. <laughs> the blade finds purchase and blood pours down. As they slowly slow to the ground. And with a 12, not a sound peeps out of them. From behind. As you stab this one, their voice echoes out slightly, but with a quick grab, they fall to the ground. But it was quite loud compared to the others. Just gonna pat him down for anything of importance, real quick. Any insignias or coin if he has it. Rolling. With a five, you notice they don't really have too much coin on them. Their armor is as rough as you saw. If anything, with a closer look, you see it's very mismatched. This this is no mercenary. But sadly, with a five, there's no real coin on them. <laughs> Nothing really of value. <sighs> Move forward if you want. That last one wasn't too quiet, though. We were decent. We were somewhat decently away. Unless they have more round, we'll be fine. The better we do this quicker, the better that we can get out. Something around those parts. So, uh, just be ready. Maybe the wolf are back again. The fucking what? 
They're wolves. The one who fucked us up earlier. Did you sign anything? You don't even know how to write. <laughs> That's right. <what> behind. <laughs> yes, knife by in purchase. You see one of them looks for a moment, but is distracted from a bug, and you find the time to get him behind the bushes just in time with a six. Just barely. <laughs> Me to do with those or leave them? We'll leave them. Go for the priest. You stand here as men move past you through the brush. Fucking God, I hate the fucking foliage out here. Slower and slower, you move all up. Rolling. With a 15, as you stand here looking towards the camp, you see the man ahead, just barely through the brush that was laying in the ground with the blue tunic. You notice something now that you couldn't see earlier. You see a large red marking on his leg with an arrow in it. You see his face is very pale. It's hard to tell at this time, but... The numbers you see there look to only be around five, maybe. It's not looking too good. We're gonna have to be quick. How do you wanna do it? Kill the one by the tree. He's separated from the rest. The 16, the kill is flawless as you cover their mouth and they drop into your head.
Like the wolves, sometimes the occasional orc, sometimes the weird peasant person who comes out. I guess back from behind. With a 15, the kill is quiet as the mouth is covered and dropped to the ground. Two weeks away from retirement. I'm so sorry. From behind. This one obviously injured. <sighs> Drop it. We don't have to do this. Right into this man's leg. <sighs> Lay down, put your head on the ground. You see them bolt away as you try to shove them on the ground, running through the woods. As you look, you see movement just to your left as you continue to tread forward. <laughs> Throwing knife. What? <laughs> Rolling. With a three, it goes wide. <laughs> Landing against the rocks. St fucking stop. Don't make me throw another one. You look at them, you see them battered, bruised, and bloodied. It's okay. They were not one of the ones that were fighting earlier. You don't need to die. Come back and we'll let you live. But if you run, I have to kill you. Rolling. With the twelve, as you say the words, you see the shaking and nervous woman in front, scared for their life. But you see them slowly lower their guard and drop to a knee in pain, as the injuries grow more and more on them. Okay, we have a medic. <sighs> Fucking. Come on. He's gonna walk you, hand on your shoulder.
fast and quick and there's many people terrible. shifting in and out lost a lot of blood and he's very in and out i was not you hear his voice come out here and there was your group a part of it <clears throat> all right okay, so again and that and that was with the arrow bracket in the uh major the most i know yes is that my group was <clears throat> here to rob him of some coin <laughs> Hey, you're fine. You're fine now. So, you so any no other wounds on him other than the arrow bracket saying. treatment? I have no more information. With a four soma, you don't see anything. And that you attacked but, this month. From what you can tell, that was the worst. Anything else looks like maybe he treated it himself. Or I was looking tried. over the yeah. camp. They were the ones that All took right. him. All right, he should be fine. The ones you're with? Uh, Correct. That's really like myself situated <sighs> that one should just be I was laying down me a moment ago from the wolf attack <laughs> till this one over here decided to point their sword towards me you need to hurry the scouts might be coming back come on yeah we're going to to are we sure that's get, our man get him up I got it got it got it come on him I'm gonna put you over the shoulder and then just pick you up. Oh, his hands are bound, so... He's gonna whisper. Oh, shit, hold on. Are you Erlandi? He's gonna use this and very carefully cut, cut, uh... Cut the rope no. on him. It's cut the rope. The man's barely, uh, able to stand. He's leaning on the tree with everything he has. <laughs> gonna put him over his shoulder maybe you'll have answers bring the legs out fold in the arms on the chest again why are you here we just banded it so we don't have time for this as you look out right. you see yeah. movement in the distance slow movement, <laughs> movement. Okay, come on, either to the bridge or across the lake. We got two Let's options. Go. Pick him up, we're leaving. I already have him. We got him. I got him. Okay, we which way? The lake or the bridge? Back. Oh, you're fucking kidding me. We gotta go. How many? Go, now. Three. Okay, let's fucking go. run. We need to fight them. Let's go. As you start moving and running, they start chasing and tow. Oh, Go, for fuck's sake! Lead them up a little bit, Sif. Towards you with a 21, the armor catches in and bounces away as Sif comes in. Don't do this. Come on, be smart. The blade sinks deep as blood pours out from the man, and the sword rips the neck. Rolling. Sith, luckily, the sword was was blocked by Kyler just at the last second. Away from the dress. Oh yeah, no, fuck that shit. We're leaving. What are these guys? Actually, it doesn't fucking matter right now. Let's go! Bring Get out of here! 
I don't know what that means, but yeah, come on. Brother. Huh. I'll take that. First well. Just down the path. We've been here before. Just like the boy. Uh, yes, pretty much. Let's go. Yes, let's hurry. This leads to a fucking house. Yeah, keep going. Which way? Right. Through the streets. Come on. Come on, my dear friend. You're going to be all right. You all trudge through the grass, bloodied and bruised. The man weaving out with mumbling words Left bridge. coming from him. Left. Main road. All right. You're all right. Go. You're all right. I think, uh, That's where you put down me. here to the right, along the slope. We'll get back to the main road. <sighs> Which is condition, Soma? He lost a lot of blood, but I was able to manage with the L bracket. He needs to head back to the infirmary. <laughs> Left, there's a bridge. Like more that way. There. I'll leave. Yeah. Go ahead. Let's go. You all continue to trudge forward, ripping through the grass, running and moving as quickly as possible. Blood pouring, if not your own, of others. The man grasping for air continuously. <laughs> so much does he have to go to the infirmary? Or can he be some somewhere else? I would need to check up on that at another time. Why? <laughs> okay. Ugh. Right at the fucking end, too. I believe there might be a ramp. I'm gonna go check. We can walk across the stone. <sighs> yes, but will we be safe from it and not slip and fall in the fucking high end waters? <laughs> Just well, step here, slowly. Go. Ah, fuck. 
take care of that. Hold on. All right, come on. As you move them one by one, the arm aches more and more, Seth. Blood pouring oh. from it. Fuck. Come on, just a little bit. Do it. Come on. Be here. Get an arrow, grab your fucking arm. I broke it off. It's gonna need you. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go. Up the ramp. To the right. This way. Oh, fucking hell, thank the gods. All right, a little bit up further and then... A little bit up further and then we can rest. All right, if you say so. You see the movement again to the right side over and over, many bodies looking and peering around in the direction you were. You're gonna move, now is the only time to move. Come on, come on. There's the trees in the brush. It's cover. Look at the minimum, it may be. Oh, fuck it, we'll bring him over to the damn farm. Fuck it. What? We need everyone else here. I need to treat. I need to treat right. Sif. Oh, Get Sif over here. I'm going to treat her. Pain. You treat her. Fuck. He's gonna see it. Uh, major critical. You look at it. It looks like a critical. So I'm as you see, so much blood has been pouring out for a little bit now. Clamps. Understood. Your clamps come out and clamp the wounds. It's painful, Sith. As the wounds, it's closed roughly, but eventually the blood will stop pouring, but your energy will be very less with so much blood lost by the the way here. You'll need some help moving back to town. Is everything you do so rough? It's gotta be quick. Help her! He's gonna look for any weapons on you. As you look, you do find a mace that looks There's like that was in his boot, tucked away. It was hidden under off the off sleeve of the pant. On, Understood. And you also see he has a gambeson on him. I'm coming back. I'm back. Yep, I'm carrying you. Sure you want me to bring him to the fucking farm? Picks you up again, yes. up to his shoulder? treated his damn wound. So far from as if I know again, it was only the outbreak that ever came in. Yeah, you be. Okay, we're just gonna go to Nottis. Going home. I wish we could go home. Nottis isn't the home. Anyone else injured? Well, it's home now. Ah, uh, we'll figure it out when we get there.
<sighs> See the keep. He's gonna whisper to you, Harry. Are you sure? I'm fucked up. Yeah, that's fine, because he's still back at your place. Oh, at least I'm the only one that can use the Nice. <sighs> Thank you all so much. I appreciate it. <laughs> You're welcome, Shinfo. Thanks, Shinfo. Thank you, Shinfo. Yeah, thanks, Shinfo. That was really cool. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. It's fine, PCs. <laughs> NPCs, thank you all so much. <laughs> That was really cool, Shinfo. Thank you for that. It was really cool. Thank you, NPCs. Thank you all so much. Thank you all, NPCs. I'll remember this. Don't anger the gods. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be a shame if a horn of bees came out of the side of these plants. Ah, the bees! Ah! Oh no, the bee mod, the bee avatar. It's oh, coming. It's I'm, coming. I'm, I'm, I'm immune to poison damage. Uh, all trudge okay. forward, though. Exhaustion oh, setting in. Sprinting all the way here with your injuries and wounds. Blood pulling <clears throat> from you all. There's a sense of relief as you start to see the castle of Nautis in the town ahead. A sense of some relief to those of you who are you call this home. of your dress, Sif. No. That was cool though. And this music slaps. Put me in, 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 put me in. I didn't want to like take away from um, King Scourge's bit, so I was letting him basically direct me on like where to go. I felt like that was pretty cool. Him like pointing to the person that he wanted to die and shit like that. I didn't want to be like, I I'm gonna just me, I'm saving everyone. I was letting him direct me. Okay. Okay, because it's huge. Yeah, I mean, it's his thing. <laughs> it was good teamwork. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't want to be, you know, that guy. So I was like, I wanted him to, you know, it was his thing. That's why I kept deferring to him on what to do. Could have got a favorite if it kept him from being killed. Maybe. 
Maybe. It was a good squad. It was actually really good. It was a nice combat squad. We had uh, Rin with the bow on range and stuff. Where the fuck is Sif? I've been here the whole time. Yeah, I watched that off, and uh, one more thing. Uh, Thanks. <sighs> of course. My old god, Soma, since I brought you on thing a shark, you're getting more and more adventurous. <laughs> <laughs> At first, I didn't want to. However, they all convinced me, uh, anyways, yet again. Are you holding up, Eddie? Just had to be careful next time. And look, they look. Worse for wear. Uh, I'm actually doing okay. Yep. So my fix my leg. Just stole my bucket. Apparently, Just... see a gun with it. <laughs> good. You did oh. good. <laughs> if I might need yeah. to go back for that. I think I get paid about a you might need to go back three to five silver. Then, I guess. <laughs> But hey, at least you're free. All right. Hopefully, uh, I can bend your ear a little bit. Let's do it. Let's go have a talk. Where to? Oh shit. Yeah. Oh, wherever you wanna. My house. So you're not. Sure. Right. That works. Yeah. He make sure you tell adjust, Basil yeah. we. You don't see a wound on him. Your back yeah. Hole. Tell Basil how no, fucking good. Throw your armor. <sighs> no. All good, actually. Okay. <sighs> Cool. I need to speak Good. to you. I'm about to have a conversation with Rin. Ah, uh, get a line. I'm still. It's really quick. I just me. need to get. I just need to get something from you. Okay. What do you need? <laughs> um, those two um, totally normal and conspicuous rocks. To you try pay, something. Yeah. Pay me and for them. them. I'm not going to take them. I'm just. Want to see if it works, and then if not, I'll bring it back. If so, we'll work something out. So you can rent them from me. I'm kidding. Let's head to the house. I'll grab them for you. <laughs> I was about to say. Are you entertained? <laughs> or not? Fine, then whatever. I'm like you can come with me. Thank you. I see. It's a long fucking day. I am being in game pay for this. Are we going in? Yeah. Or staying out here? Going in. Oh, okay. Woo! It's basically a hostel at this point anyway. Let me go grab him. I'll be right down. So, you guys I think your find room's the bigger than my entire apartment. Yeah, we did. Yeah. Oh, I don't really get much use out of it, though. Guys. Wasn't sure what they were doing with them. They didn't seem to belong to a specific group or something. Rather baffled. See anybody in the woods? Best of luck. I think we uh, stunned them. <sighs> Thank you. I'll bring them back if nothing happens and. Like I said, work something out if it does work. Like you break it, you buy it. You would expect them to be you know, <laughs> part of a particular merc company. Maybe they're getting paid off. Maybe the guy is that important or valuable. I don't know. It seemed like they were just kicking around in the woods. Not doing anything specific. <sighs> Sorry. 
What have you two been up to? Learning stuff. Oh, what kind of stuff? Like, a lot of stuff. That's the reason why Garbom was like, passing out last night, actually. Uh, All right. So much stress. Yeah. Uh, I'm good. We can get out of your hair now. Okay. Shall we? Oh, Rina almost died fun. last night. It was crazy. What? See you. Yeah. <laughs> you see. Oh yeah. Gurban did mention something about uh. Uh, what is it? The uh. The Ashmeth lost elves and emissary and. Uh, the guard. I'm gonna clash. Out of Vezrin's. Vezrin, yeah, I don't know. Uh, the royal guards came to Vezrin's, I guess. And the uh, elves showed up and started fighting the guards. Did I miss anything? Uh, no, I think you got it. Right. What's on your mind? Well, that's <laughs> a lot, actually. But, um, I was hoping, and it's gonna sound weird, I was hoping I could hire uh, a particular individual walking around town named Savatar. A little bit of, uh, you know, a little bit of listening, asking. Savatar might already something. know what you need, but what do you need? And I can. Get it to him. Really? That depends. Well, uh, have you spoken with Morden yesterday or today? About? Well, I don't know if he mentioned something to do with me or anything of the like. No, Morden hasn't mentioned anything to you. Or about you. Okay, well... I guess I can fill you in on some things here and there. I don't want to go into a detail too much. I don't know how it is to talk about it. But I'll... Is there a place we could, like, sit down? Yeah. From the, you know, the, the front door? Uh, shh, Come into my room. Ooh. I like it. Wow, we do have a lot more stuff here than I do. Yeah, it's with, with the mercs. Quite fucking strange. It's nice though. Okay, well, let me go ahead and uh, get down to it. You remember I talked about my merc company? Yes. The uh, the Iron Forge, oh, not the Iron Forge, the Blood Forge company. Well. Uh, my chase has led me from Ireland to here. Isn't this where they I started? Of things going on. There. <sighs> That's where they started, and then they left for Ireland. Seems like they made the way back, and I'm not sure if they're hiding or tracking somebody or what the fuck. They're doing. <sighs> but clearly, they're leaving me out of it. Okay. I'm not sure why. What, do, do they, they know that you're looking for not. him? You're looking for him? Them? Well, probably not. Well, they could assume, uh, I reckon. I haven't found a single trace so far, and I was hoping starting in Nautis would be easy. Okay. You know, with the Radons of Apex, maybe somebody will have a hearsay over what happened. Right. I mean, the company is registered with the Merc Company, and through the Apex, through their, you know, generous push towards uh, Merc companies becoming a, you know, a staple of Gradia. I was hoping something would turn up. Nothing. Hmm. So far I had nothing. Until there was a bounty for a very close, uh, let's say, family friend. Uh, the name Frodar. Does that ring any bells? Haven't heard of it. Good. You don't want to know. Fucking bastard. Anyway, I had to hunt down his head. 
and he'll be the only one that would know anything about my company. Mm -hmm. Right? When, when things went down, when when jobs were a little bit dropped, or you get slim picking, right? You have to share the coin between the whole group, right? Right. It's not just a single merc being paid. It's a, it's a whole group. So sometimes things were a little bit slim pickings, you know? Sometimes it was great. Sometimes it was just flat out terrible. Yeah. Rodar was our man in the middle, I suppose, our contact to get us jobs that were unsavory but paid a lot. Uh, things like buck. Uh, I mean, anything from kidnapping family members to, you know, Making sure people know not to mess with, you know, certain names, certain families. Sure, I've been there. Certain yeah. abilities, things like that. The kind of things that, uh, it's borderline, you know, borderline thievery, borderline robbery, but it's professional pay. Yes. Sometimes I... it was really fun things like... Anyway, I don't want to go into too much on detail, honestly, it's not interesting. Specifically, though, he was... The only one that would know anything about where the company would be. This last job had to do with the cradle of Isara. Hmm. Do you remember? Um, yes, I haven't heard that in a while. Farhal. Yeah. Yeah. Well, apparently, from what I gathered from having uh, Frodo's letters and memoirs be. Uh, not just translated, but deciphered. Uh, turns out that my company was hired to work for the Cradle. I didn't know about it. They must have left me out for whatever reason. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Maybe because I was the youngest, or I don't fucking know. Am didn't anyway, you have that I dagger was that the, was the runt? Weird and yeah, I still have it. It's uh, you know a bit of a wear and tear, but I still got it. Wasn't that related to them somehow? Yeah. This stuff is ornamental. Mm. It basically belongs to anybody of high renown within the cradle. This thing is everything. It's the key, it's the emblems, the... Uh, I, I don't know, maybe a fucking decree of cult royalty. I don't fucking know. Mm. But so far, anybody that's important, anybody that is mattered in any way, such as the, the Magister... Uh, back in Ireland, right, and the uh, the daughter of the nobility in Bear Hollow, they both had this. This specifically came from the magistrate. So, <sighs> it's just a lot. Yeah. Anyway, how was I? <sighs> All right. Anyway, after having the letters deciphered. What I've learned is, Frodar does not know where the fuck they are. Mm. They haven't been able to run into each other since, which is good. That means they haven't had encounters, they haven't attacked each other, and likelihood of my company members being alive is high. However, I've learned that in the cradle, they're not as, as expected. They're all over Gradia. But, there's apparently a contact that Frodar does not know about. My uh, leader and adoptive father, Tally, apparently has somebody here in Nautis, um that knows them, worked with them, something. Some sort of a comrade? I don't know. Somebody that they specifically know. Frodar knew there was somebody here, but just couldn't figure out who the fuck it was. I need to find him, because if he knows where Tally is, if he knows anything about if Tally mentioned a specific place, or a plan, or I don't fucking know, maybe had a hidden map somewhere, he might be my only solution to finding my company. Hmm. But I don't know who the fuck it is. You don't have a and name. And the last thing I want to do is run around the streets. No, no name. Hmm. And that's my problem. I could walk around the street and say, "Hey, do you know about the uh, alley of uh, Bloodforge?" Most people look at me like I'm like I'm an idiot, but then I'll be putting myself marked by the cradle. Mm. We, anybody around Nautis could be part of the cradle. Anyone. And uh, <clears throat> I, I don't know what to do. 
I am desperate. I can have... I will give you money. I will give you pay if you could look into this for me. I have nobody else in Nautis that I can trust with this. I know that you live two separate lives as Sharik and Savatar. Maybe, maybe, potentially, Savatar could find somebody or something. I'll have him look into it for you. I'll put some feelers out and see if uh, anything turns up. The name Tali, was it? Of, what was the company name? Tally. Tally. Tally is the name. Bloodforge Company. Bloodforge we Company. We didn't have last names. Um, Something we did as a company is uh, when you join, it didn't matter who you were. You just have your name and that's it. Your family, past. It's like a way to just, you know, abandon whatever that happened. And you start. Hmm. I'll, um... Put some feelers out then, and see what comes back. Uh, I know money talks in Gradius, so... You've already paid for it, remember? How much can I? I did? Yeah, when you went and helped us out there. I can't have you... Hold on. How much? Three silver? Four? How about if I get something back, you pay me? Otherwise, it's just a waste of money. Well, in case you get something back, I need you to have the money on you just in case. You never know, right? But better safe than sorry. If you insist, I will. If you don't but... happen to find anything, look, look, listen, you do me a huge favor. And in a way, I am kind of putting Savitar on, you know, on in dangerous position. If Savitar goes asking about anything the cradle is, you know, gives a shit about. Maybe, potentially, this could be kind of dangerous. <sighs> okay. I, sure. I'll hang on to it, then. How much? Four? I think five will be better. You know, fuck it. Five. Sure. Well, good measure. Thank you. Put it to good use. Um, yeah, I'll do my best, and I'll come to you as soon as I hear anything, if I hear anything. If you need more help with Reese, or other, I'm always around. I appreciate it, Rin. <sighs> you guys have been very kind to me, Arlen, you and father people, your family. You guys are good people. Probably the best that could be here in Gradia. Um. Do you know that Quinn's in town? Yeah. I spoke to her. Just letting you know. I believe something might have happened. Yeah. Definitely. Well, her her past life is not that, I don't believe. I think that she might have fucked up. This is her current position right now. Just figured I'd let you know in case you didn't. <laughs> I I would have fucking noticed her easily. I figured. That red hair and those green eyes. I mean, she stands out among I know, but you can be aloof sometimes, you know. Uh, anyway. Thank you. Of course. I really do. If you need more funding, if there's anything I can do, don't hesitate to let me know. Of course. Thanks for your help today. Sure. <sighs> okay. Let me see you out. I think I need some. F oh, <laughs> yeah. <sighs> Oh yeah, um, would you mind asking your father if he could, uh, I don't know, reconsider the deal with the, uh, the Dowie and the other worker? Apparently they kind of had a scuffle. I've tried. Yeah, I've... No. I've tried. I do most of the our dealings with her for that reason. Ah, I see. Got it. I think they're getting along. Uh, 
we had a talk and stuff, but... Oh, that's good. Yeah. Need all the friends we can get at this point. Yeah, fuck. All right. <sighs> well, fuck, it's still bright. Go ahead. You gotta do more things, apparently. I suppose. I'll see you around, around. Fucking busy. <laughs> sure thing. And I still fucking see it. You're a nice enough person. I see it too. Please excuse me. Oh, Shriek. I got the iron bars okay, done. See, uh, and see. another thing. Uh, Zine got a big order of steel things. Can you teach me how to make steel? Oh, no. I know you, we need more heat. Uh, that's kind of a long process. And by steel, I mean he needs eight steel bars. <laughs> Okay, so now oh. I just... Like, and we got a oh. massive okay. shipment of no, all the materials for it. I'm not sure if Tazim's right. told you. I'm going to Once I figure that out, I'll figure it out. God, that, that figure it out. Yeah. knows that I put it back because of our conversation. Okay. Uh, okay. It's uh, a steel safe. For who? He will be the one making it. Yep. Uh, for Saltis. The was the god was deafened, so I, I couldn't yeah. pray to him in particular. Now that can... was the hard part. <laughs> <laughs> and they've paid, they've given the materials themselves, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. They just right. need, Tizim just needs to do the work, but I was thinking I could help by learning how to make steel, and then when Tizim's not available, I can make the steel. Yeah, when that happens, I'll, uh, I'll oh, let you know. Yeah. Alright, right, sounds good. Oh. Three terminals, they were both destroyed. Well, you owe me quite a bit of money, then. In fact, I'm gonna walk with you and, uh... uh ooh, I've got to, you know what? I've got to leave town all of a sudden. It's fine, you can run if you want, <laughs> if it makes you feel safer. <laughs> I'll let you know. Mm-hmm. My leg. Medical office. I need to get stuff from him. I don't need him in a bad <sighs> I would never okay. assault one of your medical offers. Yeah. <laughs> offers? I said There's officers, you didn't hear a shit, thing. Hey, how about you go look around town and see if you can find some more invisible shit, eh? <laughs> Yeah, I can remember Please, that. Tang, do you have the power to do that? Hold on. Do you have the power? Do you actually have the power to do that? Do power to do that? Do that? Warforged magic. Exactly. You can see things so dark. Just like viewing magic. You know, where they're able to just do this, and then all of a sudden there's like a cup. If that's the case, can you can you see my will to live? Because I surely sure can't find it. That means you. Oh. Give me that separate. Yeah. Oh, the hell is Skippy Coo just there? Take that. Oh, you you went for strangling. There you go. Okay, see that that was threatened. Thank you, Mr. Tank. I needed that. Yeah. Yeah, he had. Oh. Pause. Pause. I didn't even do that. <laughs> 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 Something was happening. <laughs> 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 Hey, you feeling? Seen more than around? Uh, not recently, no. Um, I'm fucking exhausted because the adrenaline wore off. 
My arm hurts. Other than that, I'm okay. Hmm. Nice to see your dress is still, you know, attached and stuff. Yeah. That said, if you ever want to swing by, first massage is on the house. You can ask Soma, I'm nice and thorough. Thanks, Sif. That's not asking, Shriek. I don't want a massage. <laughs> 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 Maybe a good source of energy. Mr. Uh, have thick enough Black skin. assistant, can I have a word? Do you, do you know that farmer? He looks like he just had his soul crushed. What'd you do to him? I told him he was a grandfather. <laughs> Anything for you. <laughs> the man knows how to swing up, but he's a farmer. It's fucking Gradia, dude. I don't know what to tell you. Hey, do you want the... to <laughs> turn my hands back into normal? <laughs> you know what? He's got a fair point. <laughs> right, never mind. Bye! Dude. <laughs> Everything handled? Aye. Good. Let me know if you need anything else, yeah? Same with you. If you require anything. Stay safe. Especially with this whole business with Soma. Yeah. That's a whole fucking thing. Just go over there and just stand there and see if they I'll notice give you. Tell me you go stand behind Tang. Oh, no. Are we guards now? Yes. There are the new guards, huh? You might tell me where you're going! Well, you have to tax people who run, who wear hoods, and who wear masks. Go barefoot, and if they have all three of those things, you tax them three times. <laughs> I got my flippers. <laughs> oh god. Taxes have been paid. You gotta stop letting people kick you, by the way. <laughs> what do you mean? No one's kicked me today. You gotta keep an eye on this one. He is a wily coyote. No, I said seven. I said seven. My arms were seven. Shut up. People have said that today. I am not even joking. Oh, uh, Sean did this. Bandits. Soma has done this. <laughs> Two other people I can't remember who it's fucking did it today. In the words of a great man, <laughs> fucking Gradia, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I, I guess so. <laughs> what? I, wait a minute. I said that like fucking five minutes ago. <laughs> I no, know. that was like three. What are and, you talking about? It was, it's the best fucking line. It's I think fucking Gradia, dude. dude. It's fucking <laughs> I mean, everyone's like, how can this be happening? Why does everyone have swords? How come everyone can fight? Why are there so many bandits? It's fucking Gradia, dude. Get used to it. Fuck. It's <laughs> <laughs> got a point. So what the fuck am I making? Um, I think Tazim was gonna do it, but we could help. I no one knows we need <laughs> eight steel bars, and we were given enough <laughs> iron to do so. How much is a proper? And I think some now. coal. That is a lot more expensive. Ooh, I think forty I with a see. galleon. Could you imagine? Right. Ah, I was oh plugged in and I forgot. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> I was saying you can probably get a small ship for around a gold or a little bit more. Mm. 
You, you say that Maybe as if that's a, a couple casual dude. amount of money. Oh, no, it's not just by any means, but, but, <laughs> but if you keep just saving it for a small bit of your money, money, you might be able to afford a proper ship. Maybe hmm. when your birthday rolls around. Hmm? Maybe, maybe, <laughs> maybe when Christmas shows up, when the Winter Festival shows up, How much or silver is in a gold. I'm again? trying to make. I'm trying to get a ship. Perhaps we can. Mm -hmm. Is it a hundred silver for gold? gold? Yeah, 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 yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. As long as you got someone to be a proper captain, or you trust yourself with captainy things, because I ain't that. <laughs> I've never captained a ship in my life. It's easy. I know. I'm sure hiring a Have crew you? would be its own. No, but I've met a bunch of captains. It's pretty easy. Oh. They almost did oh, yeah. your head on the Basically the same thing. Okay. Hoist yeah. the, the large <laughs> thingy. R rib the, 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 the poop thing, deck. Pull down the thing. Man, I know what's it. Spinning. What's that spinning? Dun, Somebody dun, 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 come stop it. Have I started? Oh, there there I'm climbing up here. That's not part. <laughs> Now I've got Trust it! Me, I'm in Trust me, control. I'm in control! <laughs> <laughs> it really shows which people here like the ocean and which ones don't. Yeah, really though, the song. <laughs> Vezra and I are just cringing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, it's great. Yeah, it's great. wow, this is a long Bye. song. Ooh. <laughs> oh, we could try to remember all, the entire song. Are we allowed to no, sing no, it? No, no, no. I have so no. many songs that the, like I, I have in my brain constantly. And it's like, I feel like one day I'm going to get really drunk and sing some of them. But like, I keep checking in out and then everyone's too busy being drunk. So, you know, it's like, oh, shit. Well, like, I, I feel like some of them were allowed to sing, but some of them were not allowed to sing. Why? Because huh? some of them are more recent, like some of them are more recent shanties, and the other ones are, have been shanties since fucking 1782. Oh, shut up! <laughs> People talk about weirdest shit here. It's fine. <clears throat> Let's see. Hold on. Uh, wait, it's, it's, oh. I, the, we <laughs> don't want to anger the gods shit. in our heads. Uh huh. <laughs> Marco picked up a very interesting amulet. You should come take a look at it sometime. I have a you weird too. thing too. Me too. Mm hmm. Uh, they yes. called it an elven fetish. Does it do it for you? <laughs> <You're> phrasing. <laughs> yeah, no. I'm just saying. They called it an elven <laughs> fetish. Um, it, it's like a, a... I think they said that there was a purple geode in the middle of a whole bunch of twigs and stuff. Are you feeling tingly, <laughs> Marin? Well, yeah, it, it was. Uh, <clears throat> veteran? There's Are you feeling tingly, like Veseran? Does it, does it make your loins quiver? So that's not the magical I ask, don't worry. <laughs> that's not what I was asking. No, no I'm asking I'm hurting <laughs> him, not you. Fuck off, don't these drop. <laughs> We're in the fucking conversation circle. <laughs> Give me this fucking stick. <laughs> No, no, I can't see it yet. Don't poke me, though. Don't poke. Stop it. Stop. Yeah, I'll help. What is it about you? I just suddenly go more gremlin. A lot of people have said. Oh! <laughs> you hit my fucking hobbit! Your hobbit? Or do you own him now? No. <laughs> That's what I thought. <clears throat> you know, remember that time this morning mm -hmm. when Tizim was like, <coughs> I'll be right back, I gotta go do something? Uh huh. Hasn't come back. And then he never came back? He said, yeah. You'll be the first person <laughs> yeah. I come back to. <laughs> and he didn't come back. <laughs> You? Yeah. That's funny. Yeah, it doesn't matter. That's funny. It's real funny. Aww. Real funny. Real funny. Haha. <laughs> funny. Funny yeah. joke. Funny joke. Funny joke. 
Well, um, this looks like things that I've seen on wood elven merchants that they carry with them for good luck. Sort of like a dream catcher. Um, doesn't really do anything. It's just um, more of a cultural thing. Um, there's uh, probably some deeper significance help. culturally, but I don't know it. Mm. But they said that <coughs> it's supposed probably to help only keep evil spirits away, so I figured it might be handy. Mm, I see. Cool. <laughs> Potentially. You know, she hasn't sure harassed would me would since I got it. it, so, yeah. <laughs> well, that's because of things that happened. Man. Yeah. <sighs> but, but, Coincidence? Uh, yes. Oh, okay. Well, you're not even going Who's to she? play the game. Fine. The fuck up! Maybe or if you... Or is <laughs> If you are to be uh, prone to information, you'll be given it, you know? Here's your stick, by the way. Is this hobby, get, hobby getting nosy? Hold on, I have a boot knife for this. Yeah, <laughs> boot knife. Stay right like there. <laughs> do it, what do is it, that? Do is that a nail? It's what is... my bone knife. It's a bone knife from It's Israel. a bone knife. <laughs> All right, well, now he's armed. I have to defend myself. Oh, that's yeah, do it. He's got a weapon. This is a knife. Do it, flip it, that is a knife. Sure yeah! Woo! Yeah! Woo! Yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. He's such a show off. Jesus. Oh. Do all kinds of things. What yeah, kill him. Yeah! Dang. Woo! Dang. Yeah! Oh. 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 Hold on, I can. <laughs> For me, uh, sorry, that, it looks like Vezrin's face. You, know, you, you went like. That. You're not getting that out. <laughs> <laughs> the, the true king. To deliver a note to you, you'll know exactly how it's going to happen. I will pull the knife from the table. You'll become king of the war for it. <laughs> Only the worthy may live. I believe it. in you. you no, that's do it. That's real. No, that's really in there. Wow. <laughs> Wow, it's, it's so strong, even he can't do it. Yeah! <laughs> it's in there forever. <laughs> oh, I, you got... I cast you out! That's, oh. why. That's right. I don't mean to. Chat, please stop asking me to work for it. This is why we <laughs> The <laughs> voices in my head are asking me to whack fuck Torty. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna play whack fuck? We can play more whack fuck. I wish you would stop playing whack fuck with my friends. <laughs> oh, did you not discuss this with him? <laughs> like, did you not preemptively discuss this with him? Listen. <sighs> If I don't get the whack fuck you, I'm gonna whack fuck other people. What? I'm sorry. That's just how what it's going to be. Buddy? This is the kind of thing you talk about at the start of the relationship. As she just went and whack fucked for Kier. Uh huh. Right? Torty, you. if you, <laughs> Vezrin, you can watch me and me and Torty whack fuck if you know, and you could like whack fuck yourself in the corner. Why don't we whack fuck? Mm. <laughs> what the fuck Honestly, it's been coming you? for like the last like. Three years, you know, we need a whack fuck eventually. I will now use the same. There's been a lot of tension. The tension's all there. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> I feel weird. It's not allowed. If you even attempted that, it would ban it's you okay from like reality. It. Okay. <laughs> To beat the hell out of you. Does that give you Marin tingles? That's the point of whack right now. Get to it. Yeah, right here in the middle of town. Do it. God, she's gonna whack fuck me. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I think they'll haul you away for shouting that before they roll me away. What the fuck? They, this is fucking profile. I my arm side. <laughs> Jeez. Welcome to our modern society. <laughs> Look at the girl, yeah. I, I do have an issue though. We live in a society. Yeah, we live in a society. I have an issue though. That is a problem. The, the last couple of 
duels I've had with people, I've won pretty much every single one. So now I'm scared to challenge anyone in case they beat me. Wait, have we whack fucked? No, we haven't whack fucked. Oh, but that's good odds. We literally then I haven't should fight you. No. Yeah, we mm -hmm. should do it. The tension's been built. Like we were in the bathhouse <laughs> yeah. earlier, and is, we could have whack fucked then. Is Torty going but to be fighting and whack fucking everyone? <laughs> <laughs> Would you like to whack fuck Torty? Can we just call it? Can we just call it sparring? No. No, it's more fun to call <laughs> it whack fuck. Because that's I mean, if you want to duel underwater, I can toss you both in the ocean. Mm, no, she's probably a better swimmer than me. I get it. She is. A, didn't we? Did we well, do a swimming race? You whacked me, and I didn't say it. Did what? We had a swimming race huh? in the in the bathhouse that time, didn't we? Yeah, we swam, yeah, and, you and then beat I the won. shit out of me. Yeah. yeah, yeah. She's a better swimmer than me. Yeah, not surprising. No, I not at all. Not good at swimming. Boat. Not good mm. at grappling. Middling at best, blacksmithing. Wow. All right. Well, Tordy, I'm gonna whack fuck wow. you. Let's go, Vezrin. You can watch. Let's go. Yes. I'm gonna whack know, fuck I'm your girlfriend. You. No, I refuse. <laughs> you, you oh. fucking bitch. I'll, I'll whack fuck Vezrin. You whack fuck Tordy. <laughs> and then you we can you switch. Can I'll go get my <laughs> Fuck off. I can whack fuck. Off. Should we go outside the walls? <laughs> Yeah, let's go out oh, there yeah. so guards can't stop us. Away from prying eyes. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Should we oh. see if there's a, a, a god to, uh... uh to yeah, yeah, we should summon a god there. and make sure they know we're whack fucking. I can't open my menu, so... <laughs> uh, well, uh... Yeah. Hey, hey Hobbit! Hey, hey, if sparring, you know if there's any sparring. gods around, no, we're whack fucking outside the walls. It's called with the sparring. Uh, they want to spar. Do you want to duel with who? <laughs> I say. Well, what? Right. <laughs> uh, I'm sure they'll be able to do it. Well, what? Come on, Vezrin. He's gonna whack fuck, fuck you in front of Vezrin, and he's gonna have to you watch. Sure. <laughs> Cedric, you don't uh, get to say it. You personally cannot say it. You're banned. It's my term. No, yeah, you, know you don't get to say it. To, if you're gonna whack fuck freak, I am whack fucking Cedric. No, you don't get to whack fuck my <laughs> hobbit. He's my <laughs> hobbit. <laughs> I'm gonna whack fuck your fucking hobbit! <laughs> this is the most disturbing thing. I get to walk on in here. I'm just gonna walk, don't worry. How's, how does hair look? It's nice and soft on the ground, you yeah, know? Yeah, this is good. Nice view. Yep, right. yep, yeah, this is... This is good. Alright. What's, what's wolf for? I'm never mind. <laughs> Probably not, no. But I want to watch you get whack fucked, but not by sad track, so uh, you know. <laughs> oh hello, Mr. Oh man. You Wait, are we going shirtless? Time? I can go shirtless. If you wanna go shirtless, <laughs> by all means. <laughs> Would you no, like to I'm getting Sometimes it's 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 nicer <laughs> when there are clothes involved, so you get a little mystery, but I think I'm alright. That's fair, oh, that's fair. And you've seen me naked enough. Um, I have. But yeah. Sorry, what? Oh, I think I, yeah, I'll just upstairs. <coughs> okay. Oh, okay. Right. All right. Don't think you're getting out of this. Have fun, all of you. You know, wackety whack, you know, beat each other <laughs> with sticks. What could, what worse could happen? All right. Don't worry. Cop was just overseeing the fights. It's just watching from the sideline. Like he knows anything. Oh, the big pointy things. Those ones are actually made of metal. Right. <clears throat> All right. Yeah, is this well, a team based thing? thing? So <laughs> well, we should do it. We should definitely do it one at a time. Because <laughs> this is going to get real confusing. No, 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 fuck it. No, fuck it. Get at each other. I'll fucking make it work. Are you teaming? Or All right. Best, you know, best. One v one. What's happening? Best of three. All right, sure. Okay. Team battle. Oh, you fight with a dagger. Yeah. Understood. I'll do progressive rolls uh, for each side. Yes. And I'll make rolls. All right? So, oh, you two go oh, at each other. I'm gonna go. get some good combat music going here for myself, right? Because <laughs> oh, I'm yeah, that kind of shit. Best of three? Sure, best of three. Right? Make general rolls for the both sides. Alright? Don't, don't underestimate. At the steady, at the ready, whenever you're ready to go. Very good with the spear. It is here. Is he trained? <laughs> I've been learning from it, yes! Thank you. Oh. You're good. 
Holy shit. I've never fought someone who uses similar style to me before. I know, this is- Oh! Great! We should whack fuck more often. Really good! As sticks and blades begin to create cross against one another, slowly but surely, one side begins to gain an edge. As you know, the recordings and hearing bells move on, get a little bit faster and faster. Here and there. But with a stick versus a stick, so the side will find it in the here and there. Pat, pat. Yep. Oh, fuck. Wow, it's nice to have someone that can keep up.